Hey guys, and um, welcome to my channel. We're going to do a studio vlog. Uh, what number are we on now? Let's see. I'm on YouTube, so I'll just look it up. We are on studio vlog number five. Number five. So it is Monday today. I have a good couple of orders to get through. There's seven outstanding, which is great. Lots of them are for the same thing, my challenge cards, which is interesting to me. Um, and I am waiting on somebody to come back to me um, because I can't do her... I can't do her order because what she ordered was incorrect the way she ordered it. Anyways, um, so if your name is Jackie and you're from Mead in Ireland and you ordered off me, um, hopefully by the time that this comes out we have it sorted. Um, but if not, get in touch with me. Um, because I'll probably have to change the dispatch date. But um, yeah, lots of them are for our new... Uh, for the challenge cards and also I have orders for my new binders um, so I will show you my, me getting them when they arrived I did like an unboxing type scenario first impression thing and um, so I'll insert that footage here now so I just got a delivery of my new binders that I've been waiting for I'm so excited that I'm not gonna wait until later, like I have planned to, I'm gonna drag them in here to the sitting room. I'm gonna open them on camera with you guys so we can see my first reaction type thing. So I'm gonna set you up and then I'm gonna open them. Okay, let's hope these look how I want them to look. I mean, they're pretty well packaged. So, first of all, I just got these, which are the zip envelopes. So, we got lots of these guys, but then, and the most important part is these oh look at them you're not gonna be able to see at this angle with this color um let me just turn you around okay so this should be better so this this is like a gray one oh it feels nice has a bit of a magnetic close here and then it opens like this and this is what the inside looks like I love it really really like it okay so I got a couple of different colors so I have to go through each one to assess the quality of it to make sure that they're good but this is the gray Okay, so down here we have pink and I, it's like this marble effect. That's what I call it anyways, like a marble effect. So we have pink and gray so far. Um, I say there's only two colors in this box. have more of these yeah it's pink and gray in this box so we push that over and we get the next box And then we have more of these 
in here. More of the zip envelope. I did order like 300 of them though. We have another pink. So, but then we have blue. And this blacky, uh, black and gold color. So, one, two, three, four. Just definitely another one. Really short is another one. And the black one. Aha. So down here is the final one. Come out, come out, come out. And we have the white marble. So I'll take these out of the wrappers and I'll show you a little bit more in depth what they look like but I am super happy with the way that they're looking so far I have to do my stock take I have to do a quality check to make sure they're all okay but right now they're looking perfect and I can't wait to start seeing people use these um, to do their cash and their budget and I think my budget sheets will look really cute in here as well and I love the little pen holder okay I'll show you guys closer look so here they are, just a little bit of a closer look for you. Um, I'm really, really happy with them. So um, they feel super smooth. They have this magnetic closing here. And when you open it up over on this side, we have the pen loop, the loop for the pen. We have some areas for like cards there. You can put some things behind here. You have the six ring binder. And the same on this side, there is a space to put something in there if you wanted to. Um, so that's the white one. Or is it cream? I don't know. I'm going to go with white. Then we have the pink. So again, it's they're all pretty much the same. Some of them just look different on the inside. Some of them are also marbled on the inside. And then some of them just have solid colors on the inside. So next up, we have the black and gold, which is hard to come across on this. But it is very nice. Is it gold or is it kind of bronzy? But this is just a solid black on the inside, which I kind of like. So that's that. We have grey. And the grey has the effect on the inside. Again, they all feel like soft leather. And then the blue. I am not gonna lie I thought I would love this color the white marble because you know it's just like the classic marble but I'm liking the blue and the pinks I really am but these are the five colors that we will have available I just need to sort how I'm going to ship them and then they'll be up on my website so yeah I'm very, very, very excited about those. I have started to use the gray one for myself. Um, super cute, I think. Um, so this is how, it has two pen holders. There's one up here and one over here. Um, so I've just put my pen on it. And also we have these um, cash envelopes with the vinyl in five different colors so all of those things are now on my Etsy shop I'm super super happy about it um, hopefully hopefully they're well received we have one order for the binder so far but you know one order is better than zero orders for it isn't it um, <clears throat> so yeah there is six orders I'm going to print off to try and get ready today I won't, don't know if I'll get them all ready today um, already this morning I had a, a fella come and do the boiler service for our gas boiler um, <clears throat> and I also um, it's my mum's birthday today so we bought her um, a gift the other day myself and Ava went and bought her a gift so um, after school we need to go and give that to her deliver it to her so there is 12 pages to reprint it off. How's everybody getting on? Um, 
you know we're coming up tomorrow here in Ireland is the budget um, so they leak every single thing they leak everything and then everybody knows what's going to happen so when budget day comes around everybody already knows and we've already been complaining about it or whatever you know um i always there's always since i worked in another job um there was a lady that sat beside me and she loved budget day and she like um she like you know infused that love of the budget day to me i'd sit down and i'd watch them do the thing and i'd look up the trackers and what the, what's been announced and half of it i don't understand if i'm being honest about it but um i love it so anyways lots of these um is what's been ordered today these challenge cards i have some printed off so i'm going to do a little stock of what i need so we have a 300 we have one of them so far then we have <clears throat> 500 blank 12 and a blank 26 one of each of those yeah one of each <clears throat> Then we have another 500 and a 1530. None on that one. Then none of that one. <clears throat> and then a 500 and 1530. So we need three 500s, two 1530s, one 300, one blank 12, and one blank 26. So I'm gonna move you guys here, hopefully it don't fall over. <clears throat> because the stock I want to get is where you are sitting. So let's see, we have, we also released some of these guys, which is like a placeholder, a thousand euros. We have a hundred euros, 200 and 500 as well. Right, so we have some cards printed off already. So we need none of these, a 500, a blank 12 and a blank 26. So we have this, this and this. So we still need four, five more, five different ones. So they're pretty easy to do, so we will get them going first. So yeah, it's the 500 challenge. So there's 26 boxes here, um, and then it all equals to 500 euros. And then I have these blank ones where you can just make up your own challenges if you want, um, depending on what it is that you're saving for. Um, and then, yeah i'll show you guys the orders when they're done but thank you so much if you have ordered from me um anytime really um i really do appreciate every order that we get in and it helps you know it helps me try and make this business sustainable um because this is what i want to do this is what I want to do and of course this battery is now blinking at me to say that it needs to be changed so I gotta go do that.
thank you so so much everybody for their orders so these six orders are going out um and i am so so happy um that i got them all completed today um so now i gotta go collect ava and then go to my mom's house so thank you so much to everybody for their orders so it's the next morning um, I just shoved on my clothes just to bring Ava to school so um, before I get ready for the day I just want to sign off this vlog I know it's probably shorter than my other ones you know I did show some of my orders going out um, and I also just this morning went through my orders for the month so so far this month um, being today is the 27th um we have had 13 orders and um, last month for august we had 20 orders um so the kind of the stats for pretty much all of them are down um like you know for uh the orders the revenue and the conversion rate um is down and you know obviously at 19 or 13 or 20 orders i'm not making lots of money and that's just i kind of wanted to point that out to people um that when you're starting a small business sometimes you know it does take time to get traction now going off if i go like let's say if i go to september last year and um, the exact same date so from the 1st to the 27th um I had 17 orders um now the revenue was pretty much the same uh so you know i did have a big amount of the year where i didn't um post anything or didn't post about it on my social media or anything january to december 21 we had 285 orders and so far this year we have 103 um, and that's purely because of those kind of middle months um, you know the well either from from really from February March April May was terrible uh, June July and it's really August and September that are starting to bring it back up um, like in July I got nine orders June 10 May 2 <laughs> you know and then um, april 10 march 9 9 so 9 is kind of the average um which is down 54 percent compared to the previous year um and the previous year i was putting in a lot of effort for it um and it is the way it is you know there's nothing i can do about it um there's nothing i can do about previous it's going forward that's when I can make my biggest impact. Um, so I have to think of other ways to get my brand out there, to get my products out there um, and and that sort of stuff. And this kind of, this vlog helps that. Um, so, and my other channel, like showcasing how I use my binders and use my products and stuff really does help. Um, so what I'm gonna try to <laughs> start doing more of is um like tiktoks and stuff um just to kind of share it a little bit more and it will be a little bit repetitive because i do want to show like the full sequence of doing my payday budgets and stuff over on my other budget youtube channel but i also think i should be showing a little bit more on tiktok and on instagram reels and stuff if you have any ideas if you are a small business owner and you have any ideas to share or something that you found helpful uh do let me know um i'm always up for sharing information um you know there's lots of people now in this kind of uh niche here in ireland um so you know maybe the market isn't that big uh we'll see we'll see how it goes you know um obviously with 13 orders for the month i'm obviously not making any money <laughs> just in case people think i'm making millions <laughs> i am not but anyway that is it guys that is today's video i really do hope that you have enjoyed it um i hope that it gave you an in a little bit more of an insight into my small business and what i do and how much i actually enjoy it and um, you know making those um 
orders yesterday really i really did enjoy it so um thank you so much and i'll talk to you in the next video bye